Hey guys, good morning and welcome back again to your Run Academy Read English channel. I hope all of you are doing great. So my dear students, you'll be amazed to see what I have written over here. NTA in radar again. What exactly it means. My dear students, I was going through again the results which were published like a day before yesterday by NTA, the centralized results, right? And something which I found in the results right now, like uh, one, two hours before, you'll be amazed to see, to notice the same things which I noticed, right? Due to which NTA will definitely be in radar again today in the Supreme Court's hearing. Well, my dear students, what exactly I'm talking about? First of all, uh, the, the hearing, it is going to start in like five to 10 minutes. So right after this particular video, you will uh, join me live on this particular channel wherein I'll make you understand all the things which Supreme Court is going to give us as the final verdict. But before that, what exactly am I talking about? See guys, this was the result which was published by NTA, the centerwise result. I hope this is clearly visible to everyone, right? Now, my dear students, over here, I felt there is one discrepancy. For example, uh, let's say if I select any of the state over here, let's say I'm selecting Daman and Dev, right? In Daman and Dev, there are two cities, Daman and Dev. If you click on Daman, there is only one center which is given over here. If I would want to check its details, right? This is the center in the Daman, right? And these are the results which were published. And this particular sheet is telling you, if you look carefully, first you have serial number marks, serial number marks, serial number marks, right? The last serial number over here is 508. The last serial number over here is 508, number one. The last serial number here is 508 in the city of Daman, 508. Now, in the city of Dew, there is only one center. If you look at its details, how many total students appeared as per NTA here? Serial number 261. So, in Daman and Dew, in Daman, there were 500. Eight students who appeared in the examination and in the due there were 261 students who appeared in the examination. So if I write it over here, your Daman and Dew, I randomly selected this particular Daman and Dew, right? Wherein in one of the centers there were 508 students who appeared in the examination and in the next center there were 261 students who appeared in the examination, right? 261 students appear in the examination. So in total in the in the one Dev, how many exactly? 527. This is 69. So total 769 students appeared into the examination and their results were published. Right? Their results were published. But if you look carefully, there was one public notice, right, which came from NTA side. Uh, let me show you that notice as well. Right? This is the state-wise list of how many students appeared, how many students registered, and how many students qualified. If you look at here, the Daman and Dew, this is the year 2023, and here is the year 2024. So over here you can see, this is your Daman and Dew, right? Go to the year 2024. It is mentioning here that the total students who registered are 609, appeared 612, right? Qualified 323. So over here, this public notice is telling you that in Daman and Dew, in the year 2024, only 612 students appeared into the examination. Only 612 students appeared. Only 612 students appeared into the examination as per the public notice. As per the public notice, which was given by NTA on, I think, 4th of June or 6th of June, right? But my dear students, the list which they have provided, like uh, day before yesterday, therein they are mentioning in this state 769 students. They are showing the result of 769 students. And in their own public notice, they are showing that there are 612 students appeared, right? So, two things, two different results which are coming up in front of us. Same is happening in Haryana as well. I checked Haryana's list as well, right? Similarly, I checked Punjab's list as well, right? There are... Again, the similar discrepancies, which I could sense it from here. Now, maybe I'll be wrong in checking the things, but I have shown it over here, right? As per the result, which is published day before yesterday, they're mentioning 769 students have appeared and they're giving the results of 769 students. But, but, but the notice which was given on 4th of June, therein 
they are mentioning 612 students only appeared but they are right now showing the results of 769 students this is just for daman and dev not only for daman and dev no it is same thing is happening happening in haryana which i checked personally same thing is happening in uh, punjab which i checked personally right where in the result which was published day before yesterday in that result they are showing more students have appeared but in their actual notice which was uh, in their actual public notes which was there basically uh, given by nt on 4th of june they mentioned lesser number of students appeared right so this is again one more discrepancy which i observed few minutes back now let's come live right let's come live and uh, let's exactly see i'm pretty much sure the judges would have i mean the advocates would have noticed all these things right and let's come live join the other link right and let's exactly see what will be the final verdict based on all these things i'm pretty much sure all these i mean all these notices which i notice personally all these things would have been noticed by the advocates as well and there will be definitely a proper discussion on it right so join me on the next live stream the session is there already on the channel click on that one and join me live take care god bless you all